In this video I'll show how to uh, change data that's displayed on one, one of the Edge 500's three data uh, display screens as well as how to uh, select a course to use for navigation that uh, assuming you've already preloaded a course into the uh, 500. First in order to change the, the data display I'll show a few of the screens. There's up to three screens that you can display data on. This first one has eight uh, variables displayed. You hit the page key in the lower left to uh, change screens. The next screen here shows some lap data information uh, that you can reconfigure to show whatever you'd like. This sh currently shows lap time, uh, number of laps, that sort of thing. This third screen is set up a little bit more for climbing. It shows vertical feet, uh, vertical speed and feet per hour, uh, percent grade, elevation, that sort of data. Hit it again and it scrolls back to the first screen. Uh, now let's say that we want to change the heading here to show it instead of heading you'd like to show percent grade. You would just press the uh, menu key for a few seconds and then use the up and down arrows to select from the menu. We'll go to settings, hit enter, select bike settings, select data fields, then you can choose which of the three screens that you'd like to change. I'll change page one, hit enter. Now you can change the number of uh, variables that are displayed on a page. It's currently showing eight. As you go to, to less data, the numbers start to get bigger, easier to read, which is nice. I'll go back to eight again, hit enter. Now you can scroll through the different variables and you choose the one that you want to change. So I want to change heading, I hit enter. Scroll through the list, I can, there's lots of different variables you can choose. I wanted to, they're listed alphabetically, I wanted to display grade. So I'll go to grade, hit enter. Now grade's shown there. I, I can go through and change any of these variables to, to show a different, uh, different variable. When I'm all done, I hit the back key, back out of it, hit back again, back again, back again. Now I'm back to the main screen that displays the data, and I can use the page key to, to scroll through the different screens again. Now let's say you want to choose a course. You've preloaded a course and you want to use it for navigation. To do that, press the menu key again for a few seconds. Then scroll down to training, hit enter. Scroll to courses, hit enter. Then here's a list of some of the courses that I've already preloaded into the edge. You can just scroll through and choose the course that you'd like. I select enter to pick a course. If I want, I could scroll down here to show a, a map of the entire course. Just gives you an idea of what the shape of the course is like. Hit back to back out again. Hit enter again. Now if I actually want to do the course, I just select do course, hit enter. This first screen shows your elevation data. Hit page again. It shows your route data. And it shows where we, where we are relative to the start. That's it.